Trials of Mana. Name's Hawkeye, renowned thief from Navarro. I am Reese. It is a pleasure to make your acquaintance. I'm Shawit, resident beauty of Wendell. light, there must also be dark. So the thieves of Navarro lived in the shadows of the world.
going in. Get ready. Taking candy from a baby. Ah, a thief! No, not my money! <sighs> you had to make this complicated. Now that I have your undivided attention, let me give you some advice. You've made a killing swindling the people living hand to mouth in this town. Now's your chance to put yourself in their shoes! Maybe you'll think twice about your dirty business practices now that you're the one who's lost all his money, huh? You should thank me, really. That's rich, coming from a common thief. How dare you! <laughs> Touché. But something tells me you'll get over it. Farewell. Try breaking a sweat with an honest day's work for a change. Thieves were known to sweep through towns, stealing ill-gotten goods from the undeserving rich. While their leader, Flamecon, held down the remote desert fortress in the sand dunes. I've returned from the raid, sir. Well done. Oh, you haven't heard. Lord Fla Forgive me. King Flamecon has disbanded the Thieves' Guild and declared Navarre an independent nation under his rule. We're wasting away in this forsaken desert. Mana power is shifting and threatening our place in the world. Our people's resources the waters of the oasis are drying up. We'll lay siege to the kingdom of Laurent in the north and create the Navarro Nation. Now, His Majesty has a meeting to attend, so you just sit tight. Flamecon thinking. He's never been ashamed of our thievery before. How can we give up our entire livelihood, our creed? And for what? <sighs> what is going on? And there's something strange about that, Isabella. I know she saved the Lord's life when he was stranded in the desert. 
but making her second in command? What's her angle? I'm sure my father has the people's interests at heart, Hawkeye. If the wells we all depend on go dry, we can't live here forever. So... But a king? Flamecon hates monarchies. So now we're going to bleed the citizens of our new nation dry to fill the king's pockets just like our enemies do? How will we be any different from them? Stop insulting my father! Oh, what? Did you want to play the part of the pretty little princess, Jessica? Stop!
Hawkeye, there's something bothering me. By now I'm sure you've heard about the invasion of Laurent. Have you noticed anything strange about my father lately? That's exactly what I thought. We two have grown up together here in the fortress, so I knew you must have noticed it as well. I knew it. He hasn't truly been himself since he went missing in the dunes last month. Fortunately, that newcomer Isabella found him before he... But I swear nothing has been the same since. If my hunch is correct, Isabella may be at the root of the problem. But no more. I will expose her for the evildoer she is. Get me a break, Eagle. Don't rush on ahead. Something's got me on edge. I better go after him. Around them. I'll go to the other side. Understood. Do pass on my message. Hold, fiend! We have you now. Whom have you snuck into the fortress? And what have you done to my father? We'll continue when pests are taken care of. I leave them to you. <laughs> oh! You children will find out there are things better left unseen in the world. But no matter. I will have you forget my little secret. Just like Flame Khan. Stop manipulating my father! I'll throw you out of this fortress myself! <laughs> what an innocent babe. It hurts! What's wrong? You have to... Run! Hawkeye! Must eliminate Hawkeye. Must be destroyed. No, this isn't you, Eagle. Fight it. Oh dear, he can't hear you now. What will you do? Attack your friend or perish on his blade? Eagle, stop this! I don't want to fight you! Stay with me. 
Hawkeye, you... You did... The right thing. Huh. Still alive, I see. Oh. Allow me to fix that. Eagle! Eagle! Oh! Uh, uh, you... You did this to Eagle! You fell! <laughs> I'm done playing, child. <gasps> Someone! Come quick! The man's a murderer! What's the problem? No! Not Eagle! How could you? Don't move! No! It wasn't me! I would never! Let me out! Murder is no laughing matter. Your execution date is being decided. I suggest you reflect on your crimes while you wait. <laughs> oh, best be quiet, dear. If you tell anyone, your friend Jessica's life is forfeit. What have you done to her? Oh, I just gave her a cursed little present, if you will. If you step out of line, you may not like the consequences. <laughs> me out! Versus. Is someone there? Anyone? Jessica! My brother... Eagle... He... They're saying you did it! But that can't be! No one was closer to my brother than you! You couldn't have! So tell me... Who killed my brother? I... Talk? Talk. And her, and her life, life is, is forfeit. forfeit. Please... Tell me... Who was it? <laughs> Hawkeye! Why won't you say anything? No... It couldn't be... But you... And Eagle? <gasps> Jessica! I believe Mew! I know Mew were framed! Come on! We need to get away from here as soon as possible! Ah! Uh, quick! Through this hole! Isabella will pay, but I can't stick around the Varl any longer. This cursed purr, as and Mew mentioned, I think it's the legendary Choker of Death! If the stories are true, once Mew put it on, Mew can never take it off! And if Isabella dies, Jessica will die with her. But the Purrist of Light in Holy City Wendell might have some leads! Mew should leave Navarro and find the Purrist. 
<laughs> I'll take care of things here. What? Okay. I trust you, Niccolo. Take care of Jessica while I'm gone. Hey, you take care of me yourself. Don't worry, I'll look after Jessica. The prisoner's loose! Stop him! 